Hi, welcome back. With the help of this animation and explanation, let's learn how a direction control valve and hydraulic ram exactly works. First, let's identify the components. Uh, that's the reservoir. Then we have the hydraulic pump. The symbol of the hydraulic pump is being shown there. Then that's our direction control valve. This is a three position four port direction control valve that's a hydraulic ram or the hydraulic cylinder and you can also see the piston and the piston rod also been marked over there that's the head side of the hydraulic ram it is called as the head side because the head side of the piston is coming at that section and you can see the area of the cylinder at that position will be more when the piston is at center compared towards the rod side you can see the rod side there that's the side where the piston rod supporting the piston is coming so the area will be less at that part of the hydraulic rod there you can see the oil flow path that's the path in each of the section through which the oil flows from the hydraulic pump towards the hydraulic rod now let's watch the animation and learn how exactly it works here we have three sections or three positions for the direction control valve as you can see one two and three the second position is the neutral position which we will be discussing first in this position the flow from the hydraulic pump as you can see as the color indicates over there the flow from the hydraulic pump goes directly back to the return line or towards the reservoir so this is a neutral line here the flow is not connected towards the hydraulic ram so work is not happening at this point of time in the hydraulic ram and now let's move uh, the direction control valve towards the right so we are moving the direction control valve now the section one connects between the pump and the hydraulic ram here you can see the flow from the hydraulic pump you can see the arrow mark over there it's moving through the hose directly towards the head side of the hydraulic ram and it pressurizes the hydraulic piston so the piston gets the pressure at the head side resulting in the piston to move towards the rod side so the piston moves back towards the rod side so the oil from the rod side moves through the return line and goes back towards the reservoir that's how the hydraulic ram actually works when the direction control valve is at its position one now let's see the other case now we are moving the direction control valve towards the position three so that's the position three here the flow from the pump is getting reversed you can see the flow is going towards the rod side of the hydraulic ram here you can see the arrow mark it hits the piston at the rod side pressurizes the piston at the rod side resulting in the piston to move towards the head side so oil from the head side goes back through the return line you can see it's going back through the return line towards the reservoir so this is how actually this particular circuit works how the direction control valve controls the flow or redirects the flow towards the hydraulic ram and resulting in it to work so we believe you understand it's working please subscribe to us for more similar technical videos you can visit our youtube channel youtube.com oblique techtricks info or techtricksinfo.com for more videos please like comment share to motivate our team thanks for watching this video have a great day.